All right, guys, controversy. That's a word we hear every day on the Internet. That's a word we throw around since the beginning of the dot-com bubble, baby. All right, guys, so without further ado, let's get on into the video. And we are talking about the most controversial video game topic of all time, guys. Clash of Clans Walls, baby. And you know, you already saw the title, you know what this one is, guys. These are three ideas that could be added to Clash of Clans Walls. And these are amazing. My favorite, guys, is the number one option, guys. So make sure you smash and ding-a-ling that bell and turn that notification on, baby, because you know we upload a lot. A lot. So your mom loves watching me. Looking good with the new cut, I know, I know. I'm looking like, I don't really know, watermelon or some shit. All right. So without further ado, let's jump on into the wall, guys. And shout out to, I believe his name was Ace Creation for these um for these wall ideas guys go check them out on reddit links down in the description go spread their ass cheeks some love baby and let's jump on into the video so as you can see guys before we even start the video the first thing i am going to pause the video and break down uh the uh the wall the three wall ideas my brother has came up with guys and let me all know which one is your favorite comment down below and tell me it or give me another idea for walls that you think superset can do for future update guys let's get on into the video introducing Premier walls. So first we got the ru rune wall, and the rune wall is root riders can pass this without destroying it first, and one tile nearby walls that link with this wall. So basically, a root wall. If you put this uh, premier wall between two normal walls, no root rider will be able to pass it without destroying it first. It's like a barrier, guys. Uh, link with the other walls, so it gives them the same effects. Ear troops may be slowed down by 10% when passing over this wall, and I love that idea you know slowing down the balloons even more making it uh your troops not feeling more powerful than the ground troops guys it takes eight 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 earthquake spells to destroy this and it costs 20 pieces of wall so the first one is rune wall guys let me know what y'all think comment down below i love it i love the idea of the rune wall especially the ear troop path um pa part and also the root riders because i know how op they are for town hall 16. All right, now we got the wall trap. I think this is an idea that's been around for a long time, but I love the way it's being executed in this video uh, even more because the other ones were like, just put bombs in the walls. I didn't really like that idea. I feel like that's a lazy idea. So wall traps, just like a Tesla, it pops up from the base and blocks the way of enemies. It pops up when there are nearby enemies in wall range, cost 16 walls. Look at this, guys. Look at this animation. Look at that animation. Nice. So it's like a hidden Tesla. Blocks off their troops. I love that. I love that. And now we got the wall shifter. And this is my favorite, guys. The wall shifter. A player can set this position of the wall on where it will move. Move at one tile. It will activate when there are enemies in the range of the wall. 16 pieces of wall. Cost 16. So this is basically, you can move your wall. So let's say somebody is spectating my base, they want to attack it, but I have a couple shifting walls and they'll be like, hey, there's an opening in there. They place their troops, they place a couple troops and they realize the wall has moved and blocked that area, destroyed their whole attack, guys. And I think this is very advanced for higher town halls instead of the lower town halls, making it way more difficult for attacks because attacks feel too easy in the higher town halls now, guys. We gotta make it harder. Look at this. Look at that. Beautiful. This guy did. Shout out to this guy, bro. What do y'all think about those concepts, guys? What do you all think about those concepts? Yo, these are beautiful, guys. Let's go over the list again. We do have uh, the rune wall, which is um, root riders cannot pass. They have to destroy balloons. Air troops are slowing down. They cost 20 piece. And we also got the wall trap, like an Indian Tesla. The walls popped out. And also we got the wall shifter, walls that can move around. I'm more, I'm mostly excited for the wall shifter, but I feel like the most one that Supercell might add to the game might be the wall trap. I think it's more simple 
instead of the rune wall and the um, wall shifter. But guys, come on. The more people that like this video, the more Super Soul will see this video. And you know them. They enter the community. So let me know which one is your favorite. And I'm out of here. Peace. Look how they be mobbing, bitch. We came out from the bottom. Can't even say the trenches. I guess we had it good until they knocked out of the